guys. Thanks for stopping by. Um, I'm on my way out to an ugly hat little gathering with a few of my friends. This is the only time we have to get together. And what we do every year is we get together and just discuss the year of what went on, the good things. I'm real excited about that. Um, I'm on my way out now. And this little hat, it lights up. I don't know if you can see it or not. But it's not ugly to me, but I'm just going to go ahead and wear it. I picked it up from Burlington. And let me show you guys the liquor I got that I'm taking um, over there from um, Benny's I stopped at earlier. Here's the Jose Cuevo with the mix. So we're going to make some margaritas with this. And of course, I have to get my Evans Williams eggnog. Um, the store around me didn't have any. So I have to go um, to my old neighborhood and pick these up. And they also had a, like a half a gallon. I was like, oh, I don't need that much. But these two together are half a gallon anyways. I should have just gotten that. But um, I had to bring one of these and this over there. One of my other girlfriends, she's making some... Um, Tequila shots, we're gonna have some wine and just have a good old time. Um, it's so therapeutic to get with friends that you haven't seen in so long. Um, just make sure you get into the Christmas spirit, just a cheery spirit, not just for Christmas. So uh, don't let anybody steal your joy. Just try to be as positive as you can. Um, kind of get in where you fit in, where there's like a positive people, positive crowd you can kind of like migrate to. That's what I've been doing, and um, so I'm on my way out, and I shall talk to you guys later. Guess what finally came in? My online Bath & Body uh, candle order. But I'm not going to do a review on those. Just my two favorites, Aromatherapy and Mahogany Teakwood High Intensity. Um, I like the older ones better. I like the scents. The newer ones, some of them are okay, and some of them I just can't deal with it. I get sick of uh, smelling the aroma. But um, I want to touch on my other favorite candles, which is this DW uh, line. I pick it up at uh, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, and also Home Goods sell them. This Midnight Breeze and this um, Autumn Morning. These are just a couple of them. They have really good scents in that line, guys. Uh, try to check them out. And also this Prosecco. I picked up that Burlington. It looks like it's by Lee Shandell. I don't know if that's the line of candles, but I'm going to research that. This one smells amazing. And also, uh, my one of my favorites is Berries Blooms. This is also a Lee Shandell, maybe the candle line, I'm not for sure, but I picked those two up from Burlington. And this one back here I got from Burlington also, um, I think it's a spiritual line, Faithful Words, Act, Seek, Knock. Um, it's more of a calm smell scent. Um, I put that in my bedroom and Bloom and Prosper may be the candle line, I'm not for sure. But um, I just wanna mention those other ones that I do have I, I actually I do use and they have amazing scents in all three of those lines you may want to get out and try some of them of course Bath and Body is my favorite but um I do branch out and I have um other ones that I kind of like the smells as well but I try to burn a candle every morning it like you know give you this calm feeling in my kitchen in my dining room and I also um when I wake up in the morning, I burn candles in my uh, bathroom. Even when I'm taking a bath in the evening, it's just like give you the overall calm feeling. And try burning a candle during dinner. The ambience is amazing. So that's it, guys. I just wanted to um, show you some more lines that I use as opposed to bath and body. But what really irritates me with candles is this. Look at that. You can't burn the wick anymore, but I do not. You can call me a frugalista, fruit, whatever. Um, I try to use all my candles to the last drop, and I'm going to show you what I do in a minute. One moment. Oh, yes. I boil the candles when I'm unable to use the wick when it's burned out, and I let it boil down until all the wax melts. And um, I'm pretty sure you can um, try this in a microwave as well. I boil it on low. The glass doesn't break or anything. I've been doing this for a while, but I advise you to pick them up with tongues. But my glass is usually warmed off by the time I, um, I'm i ready to transfer it over, um, you know, to a, another candle 
or a candle warmer. So pretty much this is how it looks. See, it's all burned out. I wish they made the wicks longer, but they didn't. So I either pour it over to another candle or I transfer it over to a candle warmer. Look at the Mickey Mouse face. <laughs> Pretty much it, guys. Um, my whole point is just try to get your money's worth. Try to get every drip drop that you can. I do this with pretty much everything that I buy that I, you know, invest in. I don't care if it's a buck. I don't care if it's from one dollar to a thousand dollars. Even with the lotions that I buy, if I can't get any more out of the tube, I'll cut it down the middle, and I use every drip drop that I can. I'm just that type of person. Um, that's my money and I want to um, get my money's worth and everything that I purchase. <laughs> so with that being said, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day, a wonderful week. And I shall see you guys in the next video. Bye.